Now on to the debate. I think the debate was a a wash. I didn't think any of the candidates made any valid arguments. I think it was all mostly bickering. I think Donald Trump um, interjected when he shouldn't have. Uh, did not respect the rules of the debate and did not respect his opposition. Hillary did a fantastic job. I think she um, won the debate. I think she stuck to the questions without deviating far from them. I think Donald, on the other hand, uh, did not give any solutions. Um, he seemed kind of maverick in his um, his stances. Uh, did not give any kind of concise or or reasonable uh, solutions to the problems that were that we uh, we are encountering. Um, did not. Uh, respect his opponent nor did he respect the host um, I think Donald has a long way to go he needs to stop evading these questions and um, kudos to Hillary I think she did a wonderful job she kept her cool uh, under the the barrage of uh, testosterone which was exhibited uh, by Donald um, Donald held his own on a few on a few points uh, talking about um, his reasons for stopping frisk even though I did not agree I think um, he made a valid uh, argument as did Hillary uh, on the opposing side so both both candidates did well in terms of uh, we're dealing with what we're dealing with here with law enforcement um, of course we need to keep law enforcement safe but of course they need to respect our communities they res respect our lives they need to respect the uniform and the law um, governing our great country I mean, as well as uh, the general public at hand also that's all I have to say on the debate I think, and I'm hoping that the next debate will will have better results. Um, I was terribly disappointed. Um, I had one of those, uh, actually plenty of time, had one of those uh, hands in the face type moment um, listening to those two bicker. I think Lester Holt did a wonderful job. I think he um, was not stern enough, though. I think he let the candidates get away with a, with a lot. Um, Two minutes should be two minutes and maybe, you know, 10, 15 seconds overboard. But in some cases, the candidates got more than, I would say, upwards, maybe upwards, uh, upwards of a minute of uh, extra time um, after the questions were posed to them. So the next debate I'm looking forward to, and I hope that these candidates will get their stuff in order and deal specifically with the questions uh, regarding our country, the economics, the social, the international um, dealings with foreign countries, uh, infrastructure, uh, cybersecurity, uh, military, the military industrial complex. Uh, the, uh, one point I'd like to make, uh, Hillary did excellent when she was talking about the um, mass incarceration and people put in prison for nonviolent offenses. I think she did marvelous um, answering that question. Uh, I was very proud of her um, at that moment, uh, recognizing that black people are at a disadvantage uh, when it comes to the uh, criminal justice system. Once again, Neil here, I'm looking forward to the next debate. I think Donald needs to sharpen up his skills. I think as a businessman, he probably will do well as president, but that's about it. And um, running a country is not all about business. You have to deal with um, a plethora of, uh, of different um, issues. 
and um, his stance on the international issues is scary, really, seriously. Um, you know, we need to respect our allies and abide by some of the previous um, laws or, or previous agreements um, that was set forth before either of these two candidates um, decide to run for office. But hands down, I think Hillary won the contest, the debates. And right now I'm vibing with Ellie Wagner, Perfectly Imperfect. This is one of my most cherished CDs. I listen to it very often. Love her voice, love her style of music. This is the Watch 33. Signing out. Bye-bye.